150 years later, here we are in Kentucky, we're one of the last strongholds in the South that's not a right-to-work state. And we've been under attack here in Kentucky for the last almost decade with right-to-work legislation. Um, you know, every other year they introduce it into the budget. This year they, you know, played a lot of smoke screen. And so thinking, thinking recently across the South, you know, we've been having a lot of intentional conversations over the last two years with key partners across the South. Um, and how do we stop <coughs> right-to-work legislation? Like, this was part of that dream that Dr. King talked about. Um, the sad part is a lot of uh, the movement has been compromised and brainwashed into thinking that like, corporate power is what we need instead of that community power. And so, but it also takes a lot of us as activists and organizers to be self-sacrificing because, as you said, like, when we talk about showing up for everybody else to fight, how do we do that across regions? And, and also recognizing, like, how important Kentucky is right now to that dream that Dr. King talked about